If you are one of those billion people who uses WhatsApp on a daily basis to message their friends and family and put status updates, this is really important for you. How to retain the quality of the photos and videos that you send to your friends on WhatsApp or you post on status update. Now the first part is fairly easy and a lot of people already know about it. Like if you send photos and videos to your friends on WhatsApp, the quality gets degraded, but there's a workaround that you can send those files as a document. Like you can send a video or a photo as a document and then the quality will retain. It will not be compressed and the compression of WhatsApp is pathetic as you may have already experienced it. Coming to how you can do the same thing when putting status updates on WhatsApp because this workaround does not work there, but there is a workaround. Let me show you how. Putting high quality photos and videos on WhatsApp status will require two people or at least two WhatsApp or you can create an empty WhatsApp group. What is an empty WhatsApp group? Uh, it is basically when you add someone else including yourself and then remove them and the group is only accessible to you. Once you have created an empty WhatsApp group, here is how it works. If you already have a photo or a video that you want to put on status update, in your phone you will have to send it to your computer. From where you can access whatsapp web and send that file to your group in whatsapp from whatsapp web if it is getting a little confusing to you let me walk you through the entire process so this is my computer this is whatsapp web that i have opened and i am in the empty group that i use as a personal notes so i can put anything let's uh, search for something that has a lot of information like so we have this let me save it 676 kb in size so obviously if you put this as a status directly from your smartphone then it is going to be decreased the quality is going to be decreased but if you first share it via whatsapp web and drag and drop so this is the file so if it is a video the process would be the same but the video has to be in that 64 MB limit. If it is outside that it won't be able to upload from here. Good thing about doing it from here is that the compression does not apply in WhatsApp web. The compression only applies in WhatsApp apps or for iPhone and Android. For some reason it does not apply from here and like I have sent it to the empty group which is accessible on my phone is my empty group on my phone and I have got this photo now one thing is that I'll save it so that it appears in photos app so here it is and we can see the quality is 346 still better but now if we post it from the photos uh, I'll first post the status update from the photos app itself so this one I'm posting from the photos gallery like uh, everyone normal photo okay the status is uploaded and now I'll go to the empty group again and I'll have the option here to post this one directly to my status the downside is that I won't be able to type caption like I did in the previous one so now we have two stories one and the other here and here now let's check whether whatsapp has done its compression on both the photos or just one photo so i have an android phone where i have an app called status downloader so now i have downloaded both the photos on my android mobile phone and we'll go to details to check out the size so this one has 346 KB of size and this one will go to details this one has 85.39 KB so this is the one that was uploaded from mobile phone and the other one was uploaded from uh, the whatsapp web so this one definitely retains some quality it has not been compressed that much that aggressively 
and obviously the difference is not visible that much but if it was a text file so small text was written it would have been clear clearly visible on the one that was directly posted from whatsapp web in a similar manner i previously uploaded video from mobile phone and from whatsapp web so these are both the videos i'll show you the details one has size of 14 mb and it is full hd and the other which was uploaded from mobile phone has size of 1.57 mb and it was not even hd so this is how you can upload high quality photos and videos to whatsapp status if you ever wondered how you can do that now you know how that's it in this video i hope you find this useful thumbs up if you did and you can also subscribe to the channel if you want to make your tech life easy i will see you in the next one till then take care